Snowcross racing is one of the most spectacular wintertime spectator events you can find on the snow. And the CSRA has some of the best snowcross racing you can find anywhere. Now, 2021 is shaping up to be another good season of racing, but the way it's going to happen is changing a little bit because of COVID-19. To learn more about it, we caught up with Ken Van, race director of the series. So for this season, unfortunately, we have a, a ton of changes that, ha that have to happen for our, for our events to take place. As you know, the COVID, the COVID situation is serious. Um, we've got a protocol in place. We've been working, we've joined a motorsports group that consists of all the car race tracks, motocross tracks, and snowcross tracks. That we've all worked together to create a protocol um, that'll allow us to race at these facilities. Um, but tons of changes. Basically this year, we're gonna build our whole race circuit specifically for the racers so they can continue their, their program. Um, you know, the manufacturers have built these race sleds. They've been in, in engineering and production and everything else for, for well over a year. And now they're here, the guys have bought the sleds. So we wanna create a, a program for these athletes to come in and use this, this equipment and be able to compete, stay in shape, stay sharp. Um, and get through this season best we can and then move on to next year and have a, a normal season next year where we're allowed to have all our fans. This year, unfortunately, we're not gonna be able to have fans on site. Um, we, we do have distancing that's gonna be required not only for um, anybody that's gonna be on site, but even for the pit areas for the racers. They're gonna have a designated spot to park with their, with their vehicle and trailer. We'd be like drawing a 25 foot circle around them. Uh, you can imagine that's what it would look like. It'll be basically a bubble for that particular uh, family. They can't uh, go in and mingle with the other racers. They can't stand on the sideline and watch the races. There's no, there's no gathering together. Um, basically, they're coming to do a job. They're coming to um, race, work as, a, work as a family to um, do their competition. They're gonna leave their bubble. They're gonna go to the start line, do the race, and then go back. Um, and that's just how it's gonna be this year. That's, uh, so basically, the whole, the whole season is being built specifically for the racers. And um, after the races are over with, the racers will get the information out to their fans um, and their sponsors through social media sources. Um, in addition to that, we're hoping to have all the events possibly broadcast live on TV or live streaming and then also possibly uh, re-aired re, uh, again on a delayed airing on, the, on TV. So um, we'll get the message out to our fans that way and, and that's what we have to do this year just to get through the season.